guys, um, so today we are not going to be doing an unboxing of a board game. Uh, we are going to talk briefly, really quickly, before we pull out the boxes to open. Uh, because this coming Sunday is yet another Social Sunday! Social Sunday! <laughs> uh, so we are doing Social Sunday on Sunday, uh, August. 27th. I was trying to give the exact date so people would know. It would be the third social Sunday. It is our third social Sunday. Um, and this, the topic for this uh, social Sunday is going to be RPGs? I was going to say specifically Dungeons and Dragons, but I will fine say hold RPGs. Hold on, hold on. Why are we just saying Dungeons and Dragons? I now am a proud owner of the Starfinder core rule book. That's true. And I will be leading game mastering a game in October. So it's going to be RPG. Fair enough. The reason I said D&D &D is because on Saturday, as in three days from now, I will be DMing the first game of the campaign that I am running. My homebrew campaign with my city oh. and my continent and I have a lot of players who want to play. More than me. And it's going to be recorded. And it will be recorded. I will say that it probably won't be up by Sunday. Uh, no, probably not. But the point being that this coming Saturday I will be running my very first full game of my homebrew campaign with a bunch of other people um, and I would love to talk about it on Social Sunday and talk about Dungeons and Dragons, talk about role playing games, talk about being a DM or GM, talk about being a player, talking about how you get into role playing games. Have you played? What are your expectations? Yeah, what does that mean to you? Because as of six months ago I didn't know what that meant. No, not at all. And I've like had a crash course so I would be, I would love to impart that information to everyone. I like it. So, in the vein of that sort of nerdy goodness. We still know, we need a better. You work on that. <laughs> We've got a loot crate today. Loot crate! Uh, it actually came, did it come while you were gone? No, it just arrived. Oh, fine. It just arrived. I didn't really realize it was here, but let's find out what this month's uh, theme is. It's super nerdy. Okay, this, oh is, this is all coming together oh really nicely. There was an adventure time. This is, it's an adventure loot crate. I didn't expect this to turn out as well as this okay, is turning out. Okay, hold on, out. hold on, hold on. There's, there's more tape. This is I'm mine. I'm bad at tape. I'm bad at tape. We love adventure time in this house. It's funny because I was actually chatting about adventure time last night. Oh. Um, with a girl named Fiona. Does anyone know what Fiona is from? Okay. So it's technically not the Ice King, it's the Nice King. What? Because he's being a little Oh, he, he's, going, he's going to work with me. I like the Ice King. Uh, and it actually says Nice King on the box. Hello. The Nice King and Gunther. All right, this is fantastic. That is adorable. This is mine. All right, next in the box is another box. Uh, Lord of the Rings. <gasps> You're taking this. I oh. have to take this. Hold this, on. Okay, Hold so on. for the record, part of me is a ch small child. Part? I, I'm fairly responsible. I'm the responsible You're responsible fanatic. children. Okay. This is a color change glass. I have a, I have a you serious, do. I've never had one. serious weakness for color. Oh, it has the, the, the inscription from the ring. What does it change? What color does it change? It probably turns brighter gold like the ring does when it heats up. Okay. I'm really jealous. Oh, that's really cool. I'm, it was my mistake calling this first. Okay. Okay. Next up. <gasps> I'm wearing this tomorrow. It's a Zelda shirt. It's the map. Oh, but it's this map of the. Oh, it's so good. It's all the. Okay, Eric's taking right. that one. All right. <laughs> uh, there is a pin. You can have the pin. The pin says that the theme for this box in August is Kingdom. Oh, this is a nice picture. Oh, Look, I can't see. I can't see. What do you think it is? It's from um the from, from the Ents from uh, uh two towers. Is yeah. it in two, in two towers? Yes. Okay, that's really nice too. I think that's it. That's the end of the box. It's a small box this month. But it's things that I really enjoy. I'm super happy. Okay. But that's not all. Wait, there's more. There's more. 
there is actually more. Um, so this is a double box unboxing today and we got a brand new subscription box that Eric signed up for for me and, and it came with perfect timing. The perfect timing. Perfectest Our of the timing. new subscription box is RPG Crate. Which I think makes a lot of sense when it comes to the things that we've been getting ourselves into recently. It goes so well with the adventure box. It does. It does. Uh, How do knife. we open it? How Let's do turn we... this over this way. Okay. Let's get a knife. Um, do I get to open this one since you no. open the... Oh, man. All right. So, this is an RPG crate. Eric specifically bought it for me, which is why I get to open it. No, I get to open it everything. Okay, sure. Okay. All right. Let's see what's inside. All right. So... This is the first crate of season two, so we missed season one. That's okay. But at least we're our first crate of season two. And this has all the things that are inside of it, so I'm not going to read the card. We're going to look at it first. First thing first. There's a t-shirt. There's a t-shirt. Um, what do we think this t-shirt is? It's, um, it's skin colored, which is probably not going to look great on it'll me. It'll work for me. I'm uh, not quite sure what it is. It's a haunted graveyard, apparently. Sure. Well, that's that's fine. Probably mine. Um, so also in this box we have some miniatures. These are made. These are pewter miniatures from mm -hmm. F and Cool Miniatures. But I'm, um, gonna, I'm open gonna open. I am gonna open it up because you know what? It's my box. I can do what I want. So it looks like I have. Ooh, ooh, I have two cultists. They're cultists. So this cultist has his hands clasped. It's hard to tell. And this one has a really awesome dagger that he's stabbing at someone with. That's awesome. You never know when you're gonna need some cultists. I wanna look at them while you're looking at the next thing. Oh my God, this is amazing. This isn't a, this isn't a person. This is an altar mini. Oh, you can use this. I can use this. Wow. Look at that. That is so cool. It has a book on it because God knows what these cultists are getting themselves up to. And there's bones on it. I mean, you really, it's not going to show up. It's so good. That's really good. Okay, I feel like you can use all oh this Oh my God, that's so cool. Continue I got to paint them. I got to paint them. All right. Uh, <gasps> I can use these too. I can use these on Saturday. So I'm going to say. These are initiative trackers that you fold and you put over your DM screen. How many are in there? One, two, three, four, five. This is a perfect number because we have five players. I'm going to say. Oh my God. Tell me if I'm wrong here. Worth every penny. We've looked at two things. Well, three if you include a t-shirt. Are you completely satisfied with our yes. crate already? Yes. Oh my god, these are so cool. It has it has a wooden shield right here where you can write in what your AC is. It has a health potion where you write in what your health is. And it has a little arrow, blue fast arrow for what your initiative modifier is. Oh, there's is. a fold line. And there's a full line because you're supposed to put it over your DMs. And right? this is DM dry erase, up. we're assuming? I bet I could use dry erase markers on it. We could also laminate it. True. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. <gasps> Bookmarks. Marks. That's not exciting. Okay, it is exciting if you're a DM and you have multiple books. Fair enough. Where you're trying to reference something on Fair a regular enough. basis. Now we have sticky tabs that I can put in my books and I actually need to work on that. I need to put sticky books, okay. sticky tabs in my books. They're bookmarks. But Let's they're bookmarks. move on. Um. So one of the cool things about oh you got three bookmarks three bookmarks my apologies the one of the cool things about RPG Crate is that they actually send you scenarios to run which is so cool so this is a scenario that they have sent me are they individual ones or are they uh yeah these oh are the three book scenarios the bookmarks match, match. Oh, here are the pictures here are the bookmarks. Smart. They're like smart and stuff. So we have Lost and Found. Lost and Found, The Rat Pack, and What's Cooking. So I need to read these to see if I can incorporate them into my What's campaign. On the back? But on the back, there are full color maps of the locations that you're working with, which is pretty sweet. And then it shows you down here at the bottom all of your monster stats, which is super helpful because it's super annoying to have to pull out the monster manual every time you want to look up the like, how many hit points does a goblin have? Gotcha. That's really awesome. And, oh, and it and it actually shows all their attacks too. Oh. And does it say level? So this is. Um, so this works with fifth edition, first of all. Yeah, the, it says five E compatible on all of these. Although I'm sure you can modify them to make them work with whatever system that works for you. Um, 
Okay, don't read them now. Sorry. You gotta get Sorry, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. So legitimately, I'm already sold. This is the best crate we've ever gotten ever. And I would have said that about Loot Crate. And I love Loot Crate because their stuff is super nerdy and amazing. This hits the spot when it comes to me right this moment. And then, wait, we're not done. There's a hardcover book included in this box. This is the Book of Lost Spells, 5th edition rules, 1st edition feel. Oh god, everyone's gonna die. Yes. <laughs> everyone's gonna die. Is this a full what color book? It's not a full color book. Wait, is this just a, literally just a book? These are additional spells that I can give my characters. Oh, I have to decide which ones I'm gonna let them play with. Okay, you go so continue cool. looking on. This is so cool. So it's just spells? It's literally just a book of spells. Most of the party are spellcasters. They're gonna be so excited. So I'm using books, I'm using spells from the main book. I'm also using some spells from Elemental Evil. Uh, but now I have another book to look through that potentially could be added into the campaign as my characters level up. They're starting at level two, by the way. So they do already have some spells and they can do some stuff. Um, and that is all that is in this box. That is a lot of things foam. in this box. It's, it's the foam that you can like punch things out. Oh, so if I wanted to pack my minis up, I could. Ah, you need more foam. Well, we should save it. Right. Okay, so between this... You've never been this excited this. for a crate. And there's minis. There's a cup, which isn't that. that that's cool. from Loot Crate. I'm I am thoroughly satisfied with my okay. RPG crate and I cannot wait until my next one. I have to read through all of these guys. I don't have enough time in the Thankfully day. it's a monthly subscription and not bi monthly. If it was bi monthly, it wouldn't be often enough. Right, right. Wait, bi monthly is every month? Every other month or is it twice a month? I always get that confused. Bi monthly, not bi bi weekly is twice a month. What's twice a week then? Twice a week? That wouldn't be bi-weekly. Never mind. Not important. Not important. The point is, we got a really awesome new subscription <laughs> yeah. that I am very happy about. I have three new minis that are really nice quality stuff. minis that I have to paint. Really awesome campaign stuff that I can immediately incorporate into my game. Some really cool initiative trackers. Plus, we got awesome stuff from Loot Crate. Eric's really excited about his nice king. Nice king. And... I got a color change Lord of the Rings class. And we got some t-shirts. This was this a great. Was excellent. Yes. Best Apparently, Wednesday ever. RPG Crate is the greatest thing ever invented for Emma. These guys are so She's cool. She's going to stare at this. So I think we should end now. So cool. Really hope you guys had a great day. <laughs> Don't forget to like and subscribe. And we'll talk to you next time. Bye guys.